bark are affixed to the canvas with gesso. Next I'm adding some pink and red Himalayan salts. few dollops of gesso. And what I'm doing here is I'm building up texture. My ultimate goal with the piece is I want it to be super inviting. I want people to feel tempted to touch the piece interact with and relate to the natural organic forms that are here, the birch bark, the salt, anything else that might make its way onto the canvas. I love for my work to engage as many of the senses as possible. Clean up. I had thought for a moment of using some metallic paint, but not yet. So now I'm applying a black high gloss acrylic paint. Its finish will be super shiny. Parts of the gesso are still wet. But the acrylic paint is potent enough that I'm not concerned about getting some kind of muddy gray going on by the mixing. The layers have a lot of integrity. And as you'll see, the black just comes out with a nice, strong finish. Gesso and the acrylic paint are both Liquitex brand. They're very affordable and yet still have an incredible quality. I'm painting over the salt and around the birch bark. And eventually I will be adding more salt to this piece because I really want those potent colors. I love the pink and the red. That red salt has a coral-like quality. Very pleasing, very striking. And yes, I am going to paint the entirety of the canvas so that little bit that isn't finished right now will get finished, I promise. <laughs> 